everybody, Music Man here, and welcome to the American Revolution on Empire Total War. It's the American Revolution mod on this yeah, game, and uh, this is part two, yes. Uh, and part one was uh, really good, and a lot of people has uh, seen that. So let's kind of continue with the campaign. Now, I do, Britain has uh, taken this farm down here, and they do have some cavalry, some cannon, a little bit of infantry, but I think... Ready for order. I'm able to really kind of take them on, but I kind of have to worry about that's not much of a threat. So I'm building troops here. And demi cannons are going to be built in two turns. Let's see. I really don't want to get any more else just yet. I will, though, very shortly. I could just go for some line infantry. And let's see, how are we doing on the finances? Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and kick this guy. I can't. I think I've already done that. I think I've already done that. So I'll do that next turn. And... <laughs> could challenge the ships, but... Six Raider is being built. That's good enough. And I think I'm going to go ahead and... Actually, Ready first, forward. let me move the... Army right down there. Ready okay. I'm going to go ahead and end the turn. See you all at the next one. And now a new turn. Enemy raid. Right there on the fur. I have to repair that. They'll probably just come and raid it again, but I'll have to deal. I'm going to have to have a force ready to go. Probably with Nathaniel Green. And I do have some troops that I could definitely bring up in order to do that. Let's bring you here. I think I'll be fine on this flank. Let's um, let me get some cavalry. Maybe a dragoon in there. That should be good for that. Now, I, I'm really gonna have to. Actually, I'm gonna have to merge. Just hit the Control A M on your keyboard, and we can actually go ahead and disband that unit. Okay, now I'm going to actually bring another cannon and Minutemen over there. Minutemen. I keep on saying Minutemen. <laughs> like it's a weird word or something. It's Minutemen. Urgh. We're going to get some Dragoons here. And I, I believe that I am yes. ready to take on this force Your over here by the, by the port. Because I want to release that port and get, get not have my trade be affected. So let's go ahead and do that and give you guys a battle. Okay. I do outnumber the enemy. Outnumber the red cards, spray coats, so this should be good. Let's uh, go to the battle map. And here we go. I think the first battle that is actually nice outside. It's, I think the last two in part one was kind of snowy and cold. I'm going to go ahead and get my guard infantry ready to go first. And so the, I'm guessing the enemy is going to be right here. So let's find us a good spot. Probably just above. And this, I'm actually meaning the artillery. Let's see. There's a good spot for you. I think this is about the only place I can. It'll be a nice ridge. Put you there. Unlimber. Now we'll have the guard infantry. Let's put you right on the front. And the U.S. Marines. Let's uh, put you here on the side. Might have you going into the town. There's not only 32 left in that, so I'm going to have to be careful. And let's put the Minutemen. Out in the field. Uh, let's put my. Let's get these over here. And this other unit of dragoons. Hmm, right over here. Probably just to protect the artillery. And George Washington right there. And let's start the battle. Cannons will fire. Good 
good shot. Now they are coming towards me, so I'm actually going to bring the Marines up. Out here, so that we have a good line of fire, as well as the guard infantry. And they are coming to this side. It's a good thing I brought my cavalry over here. Cavalry over here. Now we're engaging the cavalry here. That is the provincial cavalry. We're getting ready to rout this provincial cavalry over here. Good shooting. Bring the Marines down. Put some pressure on this flank. We do have cannons. Right, let's go ahead and bring these over. I think my flank is protected over here. Now, let's hit them. Take out that general, bodyguard. Marines. I want to bring you guys up just a little bit. Enemy general is dead. Great, great, great. Let's pull these cavalry back. Now we'll be able to flank around with the minutes men. Now let's go ahead and finish these guys off. So we take out the cannon. In the meantime, I'm going to tell my cannons to just hit the line infantry for now. Should be a victory. Up, oh, we got more cavalry coming in. is secure. Good, good, good. And that should be the battle. All of them should be running. There we go. End the battle. Heroic victory. Good, 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 good. And if you haven't seen, I have also put up a video today of building my new PC, uh, the recent parts that I've gotten, hoping to get that ready in the next couple of months, hopefully next, late next month. Let's go ahead and replenish what we can. And yes, now, yeah, I'm going to meet, meet over with this army, and we're going to push for Maine. And here, I need, I'm still re recruiting. 
Uh, trying to think of what else there is to do. Might need to go ahead and build an opera house here while I'm while I still got the money. Now let's see what we can at the do. Rate. Just a line infantry like Nathaniel Green. Do I have artillery here? I don't. And Minutemen. Any More orders? orders? And we got Dragoons. <coughs> Dragoons rec uh, rec recruiting. Now I'm thinking about calling Stark's Brigade. Let's call them in the service. Sir. Sir. Make ready. And now can do they're that, ready General. to push north with this army, and I will push. Maybe I might go for Annapolis with this army. With Nathaniel, uh, yes. so we got Nathaniel Green going to the north. Washington is going to be coming south of Philadelphia. That's the plan, anyway. I'm going to see what the enemy does, and I really need to take care of this. Battle stations, prepare to engage. I'll leave them there for a while. Okay, guys, I'll end the turn again. See you at the next one. And we have a new turn. Another enemy raid. That's my mines. And uh, Britain is actually forming up a little army over here. That will be a good one. And we're also at war with the Iroquois. Let's see if we can try to at least get some peace with them. Let's try to turn them over to our side. Peace treaty. They want 3,700k. And you know what? I will. By God, I will do that. All in the name of peace with the Iroquois. Now let's see if... Oh, I can't get an alliance because they are allied with Britain. But I think that was worth it. It gets them off my back at least. For a little bit. And let's go... I don't know if I want to upgrade that just yet. We can start Ready moving the it. army north. Anything more? Now this army with George Washington is still replenishing and I'm thinking I might have hmm see if I take Maine I could probably take this province or go for Maryland that is uh we have this army over here I'm thinking we should Forward. pursue them over here waiting for your order. And then I, I am building a new army also here, so that sh it shouldn't take too long. And, okay, we got Ethan Duff. I'm going to build him some uh, good troops. I might go ahead and get these Marines also, these other Marines. These are the Elite Infantry. These are the Line Infantry. And I think... It's about the same in stats. No, the uh, these U.S. Marines are actually pretty darn good, as when it comes to accuracy, it's a little bit less here. I think I have reached my limit on that now. Yes, I have. But we'll have one unit over here of Marines, and uh, let's see if we can tempt Britain to get out in the water with me. And I also need to upgrade that to upgrade my port. Let's go to research. What is going on in research? Okay. What I'm thinking I'm going to have to do now is canister shot. I need to upgrade the uh, cannon foundries. And I will go ahead and end the turn. See you at the next one. And now a new turn. And I finally have a gentleman that I could use. Great. I'm gonna, I, what I do need to do is get another school Unseen, at some point. Unheard. One more turn. What we got here? Looks like we have another school, so I need to take Maine for the sake of that. Sir. Now, I do have Nathaniel Green, and I really want to put the Dragoons Onward. with him. And let's see, what do we got? We got Militia and Stark's Brigade. I don't know if I want to split these guys up or not. I might. Forward! For crown and you know what? Country. Screw it. I'll put them. I'll put them both Forward. in. Mark. And we, but we still need to continue the build here. I'm just going to go for line infantry. And what I really want to do now is upgrade the capital so I can uh, get another recruitment slot because I need to start pushing out troops. Here I am still replenishing. I'm going to hold At the ready. this position 
right here on the ravine. March. Let's see if the British will come to me. And in Philadelphia, got some cavalry recruiting. And one more turn, and I'm I am going to get great arsenal, which will give me some better cannon. And actually, guys, I'm going to give you all another Ready battle. Let's see what we can do here. And uh, do I want to auto-resolve this? No, I don't. I'm going to fight it for you guys. Okay, on the battle map, and we have old Nathaniel Green residing over this battle. Now let's see with the artillery. Let's find us a good spot. I'm thinking here would be okay. We do have a slight hill we could shoot over. And let's get the cavalry situated. Regiment of horse I will put over by my cannons. Right over here. And now we got the dra dragoons. I will probably place over in this area right over here. Okay, now we got Stark's Brigade. Let's get them right on the center. Line infantry. I will probably have this be my main force. So probably what I'll do is have line infantry here. Stark's Brigade. I don't know if I want to put them in the woods because that is a that is going to be a hill to climb and they do have this position. So maybe I could just flank around like so with Stark's Brigade. And I might even do more and start confusing them with the Minute, minute Men coming up in the woods with my Dragoons reinforcing. And we got Nathaniel Green. Let's put him here and let's start the battle. I know some troops are definitely hidden. So let's send the dragoons. Let's send them over in here. Cannons are firing. I'm going to go ahead and send the Minutemen up here. I'm going to have them walk. For now, as I think they will be able to remain hidden while they walk. I hope so. Now I will be able. I'm going to start flanking around with this force of line infantry. And now Stark's brigade actually come around here. I do hope that these are hidden. I don't think they are though. this forest I can start to bring over. I just want to hit the enemy from all fronts. Let's bring the Stark's Brigade up on the hill. And we do have ooh, Leicestershire uh, I can't read it. Leicestershire Regiment. If I pronounce that wrong please let me know. Minutemen have engaged. And now I'm going to start bringing. Let's see. I want to bring this line infantry a little bit closer. Stark's Brigade can come up on the flank up here. Now, my cavalry, I need to really start doing something with. Maybe I can hit the Leicestershire Regiment or. I could come around the offshaft musketeers. Let's see if we can hit them first. I 
Actually, I'm going to start flanking around with the line infantry as well. Now, let's see if we can try to get in a charge here. Oh, they are turning around. Still reforming. I might be able to hit them. Looks like we're going to get there. What are you doing? Go, go, go. Don't let them fire. Don't let them fire. Good. Good, 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 good. And now let's bring this around. I think we've about got it as far as... Let's go ahead and hit the Leicestershire Regiment. And we have a route. Could get my regiment and horse involved. They will take a while to get there. Units, this unit has actually come back, so I'm gonna... Oh, come on. Uh, looks like we got a land barrier there. Oh, no. Now they've routed my cavalry. We're gonna have to face them with the infantry. Looks like what we got here. Muscovian Auxiliary. I don't really like them. We're going to have to pull back. But we still have reserves here that I'm actually going to start bringing up. they come. Let's actually get you all over here. Now here's my cavalry that will do the damage. Get you all over here. units at. They were hidden. There they are. We're going to hit them with the uh, Regiment of Horse. My Stark's Rangers have actually arrived, so I'm going to bring them around here. Bring the cavalry back. Looks like we're good. Flank around with the Minutemen. I'm just going to have you walk for now. The line infantry can come up like so. I'm just going to have you walk.
Now let's work the cavalry a little bit. Let's uh, charge these. Leicestershire Regiment. Leicestershire. Oh no, they got square. Shit, pull back. Pretty soon I will be able to have square as well. Come on out. Start the fl flanking over here. Looks like they're going to charge. I will do the same. They're getting ready to waver, though. See if this charge is good. Coming from the back. That's gonna make him route pretty quickly. And let's continue the push. I got better. I, no, I don't. I was thinking this was a wall, but it's not. But anyway, let's pull the cavalry back. Now it's just up to this unit right here. Continue the push here. Bringing them down, bringing them down. And they're routing. And that should be the battle. That should be it, and it is. Heroic victory yet again. Good job, Nathaniel Green. Okay, hmm, lost a thousand. Let's look at who got the most kills. Stark's Brigade, yay. Represented well. Immediately. Now let's repair and replenish. And I'm really tempted to just go for. Prepare the troops for battle. And, oh well, hmm. I'm going to continue Settle the siege at least for a couple turns. Sir. Then I might auto resolve that. And we're here. And guys, that is all I have uh, for the for the part. And I do hope that you've enjoyed this part. And this has been part two. And I plan on continuing this campaign all the way up through July 4th. So um, kind of a celebratory, uh, really to celebrate the uh, Independence Day. So hope you uh, will follow this and hope you've enjoyed it. So guys, please remember to comment, thumbs up, and subscribe. Check out my other videos if you are new to my channel and feel free to subscribe and for more videos so i hope you've enjoyed so this is music man signing off thanks for watching you all have a good day we'll see you next time